Recently, some new Pokemon and regional forms were revealed for Pokemon Legends Arceus. Today, I made Chinese for those regional forms. What's up everyone, it's me, Prof Jeffy. Today I'm going to show you the shiny predictions I've made for Hisuian Growlithe and Hisuian Braviary. Let's get right into the shinies. We're going to start off with Hisuian Growlithe. Hisuian Growlithe is an ancient regional form of Growlithe that was found in the Hisui region before the region became known as the Sinnoh region. These Growlithe have longer fur to survive the chilly Hisui region and have a rocky horn on their head. Therefore, it's a fire rock type. I gave Cantonian Growlithe's shiny palette to the first shiny. I gave its dark orange fur a nice yellow color, just like Cantonian Growlithe. I really like the shiny and I think it works great for both Hisuian and Cantonian Growlithe. For the second shiny, I took inspiration from the Chinese lion dog statues, which Hisuian Growlithe seems to be based on. These statues are made out of rock, just like Hisuian Growlithe's horn. And therefore, I made its fur a very dark grey and turned its body and snout grey with a greenish tone to give the effect that they are overgrown a bit. This one is very amazing. I love black and grey shinies in general, so this one is right up there. And for the last shiny, I went for a bit more of a mythical feel. I turned its body into a magenta-ish electric red color. I also made its stripes and fur white for a cloudy look. I really like how this one turned out as well. I really want one of these three designs to make it in the game to be the actual shiny. Now, next up, there is another Hisuian form that was revealed in Braviary. This Braviary is a flying psychic type and is larger than Unovan Braviary. It likes to live alone rather than in groups and it can use its psychic powers to sharpen its sixth sense and enter a trance that boosts its physical abilities. For Hisuian Braviary's first shiny prediction, I turned it into its Unovan shiny form, turning its belly into a dark red brown color and its wings and back into a nice blue. I also turned its psychic crest into the same blue as its wings and back. As for the second shiny prediction, I went for a similar idea and used the color palette from the normal Unovan Braviary, turning its wings, back and psychic crest red and turning the little part between its beak and psychic crest blue. Its belly and head have been turned into a navy blue color, just like normal Braviary. I like both of these variations quite a bit, but I'd rather see something totally different in the final game. Then last, but definitely not least, I went in a very different direction with the final design for Hisuian Braviary's shiny prediction. I kept its wings and back white, but I turned its belly and head into a nice dark purple color to fit with the psychic type it now has. The psychic crest on its head already stood out in its design, but now it looks like it's on fire. The purple eyes on its psychic crest fit very well with the dark purple body, and the orange beak and claws look very nice as well. I really like this last shiny, and I would love to see something like it in the final game. But with that, this was the final shiny prediction of this video. Next time, I will make my predictions for the two new Pokémon we've been introduced to. Before you leave though, I will be posting these shiny predictions on my Instagram as well, where I post a ton of shinies I find in the main series games and give some Pokémon away every once in a while. So if you like that sort of stuff, come check it out. I hope you liked this video and I will see you guys in the next one.